Smoking is dangerous and harmful to the human system. The question now is, are smokers aware of these dangers? All smokers are most likely to say no. But why no? Well, on every pack of cigarettes, there is a caveat, smokers are liable to die young. But the good news now is, a number of public awareness campaigns are being introduced by government, professionals and NGOs, although the extent of their impact is still being hampered by the activities of the producers, wholesale and retail sellers of cigarettes in Nigeria. Quite a number of public spaces are apprehensive when campaigns that aim to discourage the sale and consumption of the so-called cancer sticks are undertaken within their premises. Tumboktu Media Solutions, as part of its Community Social Responsibility Project, through the instrumentality of its chairman, Dr. Mike Omeri. Most times I feel uh, challenged, especially when I have to answer the doctors. They say, they ask you the question, do you smoke? Do you drink, you know, as part of the diagnosis? And I feel embarrassed sometimes. So I, I now reflected on it and decided to stop. Uh, one day, two days, three days, and I never went back to it since the last, uh, since then. This is more than 10 years now. But if I hadn't any condition, I wouldn't have approached a cardiologist in the first place. So I said, well, if I have to save this heart, I must uh, uh, discipline myself and modify my own behavior and lifestyle. Being an ardent anti-smoker advocate has introduced a new dimension to the strategy of campaign against smoking through bars, beer parlors and smoking joint outreaches. Difficult as it may seem, some clubs in Abuja have introduced the no smoker alert within the clubs while some football viewing centers are exclusively non-smoking. Our monthly outreaches and sometimes work with professionals help to escalate public awareness campaigns through roadworks and lectures in addition to very personal heart-to-heart -heart conversations. It's half time. Yes, please. Can we have a short discussion? May I meet you, please? Well, my name is Mr. Uche. Um, what about you? Um, my name is Mike. Nice to meet you. Thank you. How often do you come to this place? Yes, I come anytime there is a football match mm -hmm. that attracts uh, attention, especially in the news. Now, today's match is enjoyable, isn't it? Oh, yes, it is. Now, if you come here, I have seen that most of the people here, but the few, are drinking beer, but others are smoking cigarettes. Oh, interesting. Now, why are you sitting at the back? Why not in front? Oh, I tend to move away to the back because of the you know, extra smoke and other things, tobacco and other things. So, and you know, being a, a secondary smoker is more dangerous to me, so I decided to stick at the back. Now, do you think that the people smoking are aware of the dangers to themselves or even to the people, the passive smokers who are not smoking at all? I do not think so because if they do, they would have a second thought. Are you aware of any government efforts? Liberal government efforts to sensitize citizens against smoking? One or two campaigns by well meaning. Uh, organizations uh, which are not too okay. So thank you very much for your time. The next uh, half is about to start. Thank you. The challenge is how to create a number of viewing centers other than cinemas for the benefit of sports lovers who are non-smokers. Indeed, the main challenge is how to provide these options. Enthusiasts usually prefer enjoying these sports outdoor. For instance, the English Premier League, Italian La Liga, Spanish Serie A, German Bundesliga. If we have a choice, we would establish the center for non-smokers and intensify the campaign to attract smokers to quit and join this non-smokers club while surveying their favorite sports on large screens. Quit smoking today. Have healthy hearts. Proudly brought to you by Tomboxer Media Solutions in conjunction with Healthy Hearts Initiative.